Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Kuzuka Moi from Tokyo, Japan. I'd like to present 25-year-old woman with sudden bloody vision in the right eye. She had history of a gravest disease with methemazole treatment studied two months earlier. Three lab and fundus examinations showed cellular infiltrates in the anterior chamber and vitreous opacity in the right eye. Progress and geography showed retina vasculitis. Systemic investigation showed improvement of symptoms of Graves disease, but identified mild bilateral exophthalmos with normal eye movement. Further investigation excluded autoimmune disease, but investigation for infection indicated cell positivity for human T cell lymphotropic virus type 1, HTV1 and excluded other infections. Subsequent PCR analysis indicated a low HTV1 provirus load in the peripheral blood. Considering the system in the ocular findings, we made a diagnosis of HTV1 uveitis and studied the patient on the Tokyo and oral corticosteroid. Variation of the patient family on the her parents and siblings to be HTV1 cell positive. Notably, the patient's sister had developed HTV1 uveitis at the age of 24, and the cause of the disease was similar to our case. HTV1 infection is associated with an increased risk of premature death and associated with a range of morbidities, including inflammatory conditions. When the patient with Graves disease complain of sudden blurry vision, HTV and uveitis should be excluded, especially in the HTV endemic area. Thank you.